This is Evelyn, Agony's embrace. Eve lures in her prey with a promise of love, then subjects her victims to unspeakable torment. My pleasure, your pain. Welcome to the Evelyn Champion Spotlight. Let Evelyn take over. Evelyn's passive is Demon Shape. After leaving combat for a few seconds, Evelyn is enveloped by Demon Shape. If Evelyn's health is low, she'll recover it quickly while this ability is active. Starting at level 6, Demon Shade also grants Camouflage. This makes Evelyn hidden from view to all except nearby enemy champions, control boards, and turrets. Evelyn's Q is Hate Spike. She lashes out, dealing damage to and marking the first enemy hit. This target receives additional damage from Evelyn's next few attacks or abilities. If the marked target is a monster, a significant chunk of Hate Spike's cooldown will be refunded. Even if Hate Spike misses, Evelyn can recast the ability up to three times to fire a line of spikes to the nearest enemy champion or whatever Evelyn is currently attacking. The spikes deal full damage to all enemies beyond the first. Evelyn's W is Lusk Dust. Enough foreplay. She temporarily curses a target champion or monster. Hitting the cursed target with her basic attacks or abilities will expunge the curse, damaging and significantly slowing the target, and refunding Lust Dust's mana cost. Don't worry, honey. I'm open to all types. If Evelyn leaves the curse untouched for a few seconds, Lust Dust will charm the target instead of slow and shred their magic resist. If the target is a monster, the length of the charm will be increased and the spell will deal even more damage. Casting Lust Dust does not break Demon Shade, but it does show your opponent a little indicator that points to your location when the W charge completes. Evelyn's E is Whiplash. Careful, I'm a biter. She impales an enemy with her lashers, applying on hit effects and dealing damage as a percent of the target's maximum health. Evelyn is then granted a short burst of movement speed. Entering Demon Shade resets Whiplash's cooldown and empowers its next cast. When casting Empowered Whiplash, Evelyn pulls herself to her target, deals additional damage, and hits all enemies in a line through her target. Evelyn's ultimate is Widowmaker. She unleashes her demonic energy, becoming untargetable and cleaving enemies in front of her before warping backwards. Whose life shall I ruin today? This ability deals bonus damage to low health enemies. Targets vulnerable to the bonus damage from Widowmaker will have a marker above their head, but this does not necessarily mean that they will die to it. Evelyn is very reliant on mana for her clear, so it's a good idea to take blue buff early in the route. Evelyn's got an agonizingly weak early game. Her mana pool is limited, and before she unlocks Demon Shade's camouflage, her ganks are very telegraphed. <sighs> Before 6, she'll need extra help from laners with crowd control to pull off successful ganks. Be mindful of how you use your Q when clearing camps. Land the initial cast of Hate Spike on the biggest baddie so your subsequent casts deal bonus damage to it. Try to maneuver the smaller critters in the camp into a line to make the most out of all that hate you've got pent up inside. Once Eve hits level 6, she becomes a terrifying, invisible murder machine. Keep opponents on their toes and emerge from the darkness when they've got no chance of escaping. Evelyn's ultimate, Widowmaker, is great for stealing, I mean securing kills, but you can even use it for a spooky drive-by on Dragon or Baron. It's also a great clutch defensive tool for evading enemy skill shots or getting over walls. <laughs> Surprise opponents by aiming it backwards to use it as a gap closer. Try not to blow it too early though. Once it's gone, you've got no reliable way to get back in. Play more later. Once you enter the late game, Evelyn's job is to end fights before they start. Look for clueless supports in the jungle to evaporate, or just pop out of nowhere and 1v1 their squishies when they think they're safe. After dumping all your damage on your primary target, it's okay and often optimal to weave in and out of combat to re-enable Demon Shade and Empowered Whiplash. This way, you'll get even more damage out of it and regain your cooldowns to eviscerate your next target. Thanks for watching the Evelyn Champion Spotlight. Want to learn even more? Check out these links to submit to Agony's Embrace. Show's over, boys.